Hello, I'm Josh, a technical customer support specialist here at the AWS office in Seattle. Today, I'm going to show you how to get started with AWS organizations. Let's get started. To create an organization, first, log into your AWS account either as the AWS account root user or an IAM user with admin or organization specific permissions. When you're on the AWS Management Console page, navigate to the AWS Organizations Console. You can do this by entering AWS Organizations in the search bar, choosing from the account drop down list and selecting Organization. Or if you've already visited this page before, it'll appear in the recently visited section here. Here, you'll see the organization's landing page with information on what an organization is and helpful resources to assist you with getting started. You'll also notice the button here that says Create an Organization. When an organization is created, the default setting is All Features. This feature set includes all the functionality of consolidated billing, plus advanced features that give you more control over your accounts and your organizations, such as service control policies and prevention of member accounts leaving the organization. You can also see the option available for consolidated billing only. This provides shared billing functionality, but not the advanced features. All features mode can be turned on later if needed. Now, back to this button. Go ahead and choose the Create button. And there it is, your brand new organization. After your organization is created, a verification email is sent. When the email address is verified, you can add member accounts to your organization by inviting them or creating them directly through AWS organizations. To do this, choose Add an AWS Account. Now you can create an account or add an existing AWS account. To create an account, you'll choose an AWS account name, enter an email address, and create an IAM role name. You also have the option to assign a resource tag to the account. One thing to note here is that accounts created through this console cannot be removed from an organization for seven days. Invited accounts are exempt from this. Now we'll invite an AWS account. Enter the email address or AWS account ID to invite the user. If you have multiple accounts that you want to add all at once, choose Add Another. You can personalize the invitation message that is sent to the member accounts and also assign up to 50 resource tags to the account. When this is filled in, Go ahead and choose Send Invitation. The member account in question must log in either as the root user or the IAM user with admin or organization-specific permissions to accept the invite and join the organization. And now you know how to get started with AWS Organizations. Thanks for watching, and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.